All right, Shalom, Shalom. I want to start off by giving all honor and glory and praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakadash. Double honors to my elders and apostles at Great Millstone, who well. And double honor to my elder as well, Ahar One, Ben Yasha Allah, at Alliance Dan Camp here in Jacksonville, Florida. Salutations to the 144,000 hopeful elect pushing this truth across the four winds to the one third remnant. Shalom. Um, one third remnant believers on Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Shalom. So, um, it's going to be a quick lesson about, I think I'm going to name and um, take it to the next level because I was having a conversation with a few brothers at work. I was just like, man, it's truth. We got to take it to the next level. So if you're reading three chapters, you need to be reading seven. If you're reading seven, you need to be boosted up to 14. So we may be able to uh, be able to piece everything together. You see what I'm saying? For all the new brothers coming in, such as myself, I want to be able to piece everything together and to know everything so i've been praying for wisdom and knowledge and understanding so when i'm out there in that wilderness and I, you know what i'm saying I don't, have, I don't have my big brothers with me the elders and apostles at great millstone to teach me everything that i just know everything so i've been praying that the lord like connect the dots in my mind and just you know what i'm saying help me attain that wisdom so with that we need to be reading more you know what i'm saying we need to be watching more we need to be listening to our, our spiritual big brothers and our spiritual fathers preach this word you see what i'm saying so kind, this is the book of uh, Romans, chapter 12, and verse 1. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of Yahweh, that you present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, acceptable unto Yahweh, which is your reasonable service, and be not conformed to this world, and be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is good, what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of Yahweh. So kind, man, we need to um, be not conformed to this world. And uh, get in and get into these scriptures and, and and watch and constantly watch day by day, so the Lord can have favor on us when when He starts sending those plagues and pestilences. We start sending death and destruction to tear down the strongholds of Babylon. You know what I'm saying? So, kind we need not be be uh transformed to the uh, ways of this world, but be uh transformed by the renewing of our minds. You see what I'm saying? Verse 3, For I say, Do the grace given unto me to every man that is among you, not to think of himself more highly than he ought to think, but to think soberly according as Yahweh have dealt to every man to the measure of faith. So, Khan, you got brothers in these things, uh, they got more faith than us. You see what I'm saying? They got, they, they can, um, they can preach everything, you know what I'm saying? They can break things down on a different level. So, I, I pray to be like my brothers. You know what I'm saying? I always ask the Lord to uh, light a fire in me like Jeremiah. You know what I'm saying? So I, so I may be able to do his work. You know what I'm saying? Every day or day by day, no matter what happened, or be able to tell somebody or just preach to somebody. You see what I'm saying? So, so calm, man. We just need to take it up to the next level. Take it to the next level. You know what I'm saying? So we may be able to find favor in the sight of the Lord. So the Lord to turn his face and see, man, yeah, my son diligent, but he he's seeking me in spirit and in truth. So, kind. This is um, Proverbs chapter twenty-four, starting at verse sixteen. For a just man falleth seven times, and rises up again, but the wicked shall fall into mischief. You see, what I'm saying. So, though we fall, you know, what I'm saying, though we in this flesh, we still bounce back harder. You know, what I'm saying, like the scriptures say. You know what I'm saying? Uh, in Baruch, it was your mind to go astray, so come seek the Lord um, ten times more. So if we fall, we're getting up and we're seeking the Lord more. Because a, ju a just man fall it seven times. You see what I'm saying? So need to be, it's just like we need to be praying for more wisdom, knowledge, and understanding in these perilous times. Because Satan finna come and, and try to deceive brothers and all type of stuff. So we need to be, you know what I'm saying, gird up our loins like man. You know what I'm saying? And, and constantly watch day by day, listening to our spiritual big brothers. You know what I'm saying? So they can teach us. You know what I'm saying? And and just watching and just, you know what I'm saying? Not thinking highly of ourselves. This is First Timothy chapter 6 and verse 12. Fight the good fight of faith. Lay hold on eternal life, whereunto thou art also called and hast professed a good profession before many witnesses. So we fighting the good fight of faith. You know what I'm saying? We we praying for more faith and we and we fighting and constantly um trying to not really prove to our people but show them like who had the truth like the scripture said our teachers shall be um pushing no more into a corner you know what i'm saying we fighting a good fight of faith day by day you see what i'm saying and just trying to find favor in the, in the sight of the lord and trying to be uh, uh 
esteemed worthy, worthy to um be in the presence of Yahweh Bashim Yahushua, to drink wine with Yahusha, to be uh called up in a chariot. Uh, when, when the Lord starts sending those plagues, death and destruction, those uh, uh missiles, those missiles hit. So this is the book of Psalms. Chapter 23 and verse 4. Yeah, as so I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. So, Khan, the Lord is with us. No matter what what um what the scriptures say, if I make my bed in hell, they are with me. If I um yeah, Khan, ye uh ye are with me. No matter what we do, the Lord gonna be with us. He said he had care for his elect, Lord willing on that number. So the Lord, uh he gonna be with us no matter what. But we gotta we gotta show the Lord also, you know what I'm saying? Offering up those spiritual sacrifices. We gotta show the Lord. We can't we, we can't just hop in this thing just knowing you're a Hebrew. That's not enough. You see what I'm saying? You gotta actually show the Lord. Isaiah chapter 41 and verse 10. Fear not, fear thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy power. I will strengthen thee. Yeah, I will help thee. Yeah, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. So we're seeking out the righteousness and we're trusting in the Lord because the Lord is with us. See what I'm saying? It'd be plenty of times I'd be low in the spirit and the Lord would just reveal something to me. And I'm just like, man, I, man, I got the Lord. You know about you, man? Should I get in these scriptures or brothers that drop videos? And just, it just constantly uplifting my spirit, you know, so. The water, you know about you, man? Should I for the brothers across the four corners of the earth? All my spiritual big brothers and, um. My spiritual fathers. Come on, one more time. Isaiah chapter 41 and verse 10. Fear thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy power. I will strengthen thee. Yeah. I will help thee. Yeah. I will I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. So come, on, man. For if I ain't got your help, I ain't got nothing. Because ain't can't nothing here save me. And I, and I see the spirit of your help, I working on 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 brothers and I just ask the Lord to constantly light a fire in me as a uh, as he did for Jeremiah so Khan, um Deuteronomy chapter 31 verse 6 be strong and of good courage fear not nor be afraid of them for the Lord Yahweh thy, thy God he it is that doth go with thee he will not fail thee nor forsake thee the Lord ain't gonna forsake thee he ain't gonna forsake us because he have care for his elect you see what I'm saying? And, and and the Lord created all things for us. The Israelites, the Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. The Lord, He created all things for us. He didn't He didn't create this uh this whole planet, this whole galaxy to be inhabited by the by a fucking base man. He made it for his children. You know what I'm saying? So we need to be seeking the Lord. We need to turn it up a notch. We need to take it to the next level. You know what I'm saying? Just constantly fight and take it to the next level so the Lord can turn this, you know what I'm saying, can, can save us, you know what I'm saying, we got to show the Lord if you if we want him to show us anything, but Con, this is the last scripture, Ephesians chapter thir uh, 3 and verse 13, wherefore I desire that ye faint not at my tribulations for you, which is your glory, for this cause I bow my knee unto the Father of our Lord, Yahweh Shah Mashiach, of whom the whole family in heaven and, and earth is named, that he would grant you according to the riches of his glory to be strengthened with with might by his spirit in the inner man. So it's about the inner man. You see what I'm saying? Cut on IUIC and all these other camps saying, oh, where your fringes? Where your fringes? Every time you walk up, it's about the inner man. Fringes ain't going to get you to the kingdom of heaven. You see what I'm saying? It's about the inner man. Verse 17 is that Hamashiach may dwell in your hearts by faith that ye being rooted and grounded in love. So we need to be rooted in this thing. So uh, uh, when, when Yahweh Shah starts shaking that fig tree, you know what I'm saying? We're not falling because we rooted in the word and we ate the whole roll because, we, you know what I'm saying? We, we trying to show the father that, that we worthy to be saved. Lord willing, we worthy to be saved because like he said, like the scripture said, our, our righteousness is of filthy rags. So there was a quick spiritual hydration. Hopefully I can um, help edify and uplift a brother out there like like you brothers do me daily. So Tawari Habashim Yahshua for the brothers. Um, Brakatam to all you brothers out there. And Shammai, Yahshua Allah, Yahweh, Allah Hayyanawa, Yahweh Akkad, and Shalom.